is in the Valley uh, in time for the first 90 of the year this evening, speaking at a fundraiser in downtown Phoenix for a small Christian university. As Karina Sun explains tonight, it's a small school with a big mission, one of which is to get the word out that it's there. Yeah, Patty, that's right. The speech is going to get started in about four hours from now. Like you said, it's a fundraiser for Arizona Christian University in Phoenix, one that's trying to make a name for itself 50 years after first opening its doors. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Right now, there's a big buzz. A new name, a former president, and iPads for all incoming freshmen. Great PR moves for a Christian university trying to put itself on the map after half a century in the valley. Often the, we, we heard the phrase, you know, uh, Southwestern College is what it was known as, that it's the best kept secret in Arizona. I don't want Arizona Christian to be the best kept secret uh, in Phoenix. Len Mutzel is president of the university as well as a former gubernatorial candidate and founder of the Center for Arizona Policy. I really do believe strongly in, in helping to equip uh, young Christians to get involved and to be uh, effective in their community and making a difference. Would somebody else like to volunteer? Right now, the university is smaller than most area high schools, with just under 500 students enrolled in its five academic departments. The focus here is on community and, of course, faith. Everyone graduates with a minor in biblical studies. But students are also trained to believe they can have a positive impact on the world. I'd like to open up an orphanage in another country or even here. And I have this mindset of being able to be efficient, not just in here or the country I grew up with, but any other different country. And have you eaten lunch yet? The school says it's ready for more students just like these. ACU wants to double its student population in the next couple of years while adding a master's program and more majors. We want people to know that we're here. And there are about 1,200 people expected at tonight's sold-out dinner event. Tickets ranged anywhere from $100 all the way to $250,000 for a table and a chance to meet the former president. Reporting live in Phoenix, Karina Sun, 3TV. Inspired 